Chevalier, what happened to your vessel? I got myself into a bit of a scrape. Sent three ship in all hand to their watery grave. The Giafour nearly followed them down. Just your fate has been better, Le Chasseur. Indeed. My sources inform me that Samuel Smith has searched far and wide, looking for answers on how to make that strange box work. He just returned from Europe. Where is he now? Refitting his schooner. If you hurry, you can catch him there. Oh, remember those blueprints? Well, I had an engineer build that marvelous weapon for your ship. Master Pucker's gun fires more shots than an artillery brigade, and twice as fast. Many thanks. Anything for my wooded friends. Then, I will join you on this voyage. Then shall we, gentlemen? You are in a jovial mood, Che. Why shouldn't I be? I have a new weapon, and will soon have a chance to use it. Besides, Templars are usually well guarded, and I'm sure that Smith fellow is no exception. I also took the liberty of ordering some improvements. Morgan now has a ram. There he is! Likes Most himself. fortunate timing! Lady Luck never ceases to smile on you. He's seen us. Give chase. But hold your fire. We must not damage the box or risk losing it to the sea. Can't this bucket go any faster? At least my ship is still seaworthy, Chevalier. Our fire. target's a smart man. What he's doing in these waters is beyond me. Maybe he came here to meet someone. Or ran into your pirates. Hitting his ship. Something must have happened. If one of my allies attacked him, I would have known about it. Well, he's back from a long voyage. Another chance again. He knows most of the Fitmars well, doesn't he? With him out of the way, Washington entrusted the precursor box to him. He probably still has it. Shay's right. The box comes first. So we can't sink him. We'll have to board his ship. We're forcing to beach. Look, Captain. He's cutting through the ice. It seems you're not the only one equipped with such a ram, Shay. Let us hope ours fares just as well. It worked. The way is clear. Now, once more, your fortune holds. But do not waste time congratulating yourself. Smith is getting away. The fault controls these waters closely, Captain. It's an ambush! Halfway you see Diablo Nothair! Smith must not escape! Yeah. Get the mainsails into the wind! Fire!
I don't see Smith's ship. Race for impact! There's Smith. He's moving again. No doubt he hoped to be a spectator of your demise. I'm glad to disappoint him. And he's still within reach. What wickedness is this? Another Templar tactic. They can cover whole stretches of ocean with their flames. Careful, Shay. We could be burnt to cinders. It's nothing more than a last desperate throw of the dice. He knows we have him. Make it a blow, Captain! doesn't want us out here. She fights now we know where he was headed. Bastard has an encampment here. Follow him on land. Do not even think of firing the ship's weapons near that precious box. I'll take care of this. Ancient artifact. Treasure from those who came before. Yes. It matters not. <coughs> Some of the greatest scientific minds of all Europe could not make it work. <coughs> now all I need is the manuscript, and all shall be revealed. Got the precursor box. Smith's dead. Well done, Shay. Where's Chevalier? Returning to Le Garfou. We'll have to celebrate without him, I'm afraid. I don't much feel like celebrating Liam. I know we have to get these artifacts back, but at what cost? 
Samuel Smith. He could barely hold his sword straight. Killing him was... Necessary. But... But nothing. Smith was a dangerous man. A Templar. What's worse, he had the precursor box. You should be proud of yourself, Shay. Perhaps. We should head for Albany now. James Wardrop, the fellow Lawrence Washington gave the manuscript to, will be there. Kasigawasi reported that James Wardrop rooted out many tribes from their ancestral lands. We have proof that he's behind countless massacres. He's one of the most devious and ruthless men in the colonies. He uses... Stand still. You're here. Congress is still in session. George Washington and his militia have fired on French troops under Jumonville. The French are calling it an act of war. George Washington. You mean Lawrence's younger brother? Yeah, it's the same. I'm speaking of Lawrence Washington. But you eliminated him. James Wardrop has moved up in ranks. All the Templar resources are at his disposal now. What about the manuscript? My sources in New York confirm that Wardrop has it. I also learned that he is here, at the Congress, under heavy guard. Shay, find Wardrop. Get that manuscript. This place is thick with Templar troops. Liam and I will make sure he doesn't escape.
Who's he? Well, he's a traitor and was never heard of him. That must be the Templar William Johnson. Perhaps he has the manuscript, or knows where it is. As I have stated previously, I believe we need a national union, granted by an act of parliament, but bringing greater independence to our colonies. The French are an immediate threat. We are ill prepared to face them. To put it bluntly, the colonies must join or die. Rousing speech, Master Franklin. But do you truly believe Great Britain will grant her colonies autonomy? They have little choice, Master Johnson. You know the remoteness of this frontier better than most. Yes. But let us leave politics for another day. I wanted to thank you for your research. Of course. Of course. In the brief time I could examine that box, I could tell it was something unique. From ancient Egypt, you said? Well, as I mentioned in my letter, I am quite ready to... Electrify it. Excellent. We will have the box delivered shortly. As for the manuscript... Captain? I apologize, sir. But Master Wardrop refused to hand it over. He said the risks were too great. The risks? Ah. I apologize. You will have the manuscript and the box in the briefest of delays. You made the excuse for a uniform. Run to Fort Frederick and tell Master Wardrop he had better cough up the manuscript post-haste. Else I will have him scalped. I can't let that lobster captain reach Wardrop. Depends on King George. I think we need a stronger colonial government.
I'll take that, you Templar dog. No! You have no idea what you're doing, fool! Keeping the people free from your control. How free will you be when the French undermine these squabbling colonies? These colonies would be far better off without the Templars pulling the strings. <laughs> we bring order from chaos. If everything is permitted, no one is safe. Even the devil can quote scripture to suit his own purposes.
have the manuscript. Great. Hope is waiting for you in Sleepy Hollow. What's in Sleepy Hollow? Benjamin Franklin. The man Johnson hired to make that strange precursor box work. So what's the plan? Meet Hope. Personally, one of Johnson's men. Get the box and manuscript to Franklin. So I'm a messenger, then? Aye. See if this Franklin can figure out how this damn box operates. Stay with him. Oh, and as far as we can tell, this man doesn't know about the Templars or the assassin of that man. Oh, a simple task. <laughs> For a simple man. You're late. The sky is getting temperamental. That's not the only thing, is it? Uh, Master Franklin, sir. My name is Shay, and this is my associate, Hope. Uh, William Johnson told us to give you these. Ah. Oh. Thank you, but I'm afraid I must delay my experiment. Delay it? Why? The army confiscated my lightning rods. They are essential to conducting the electricity. I need to vivify your box. Master Johnson would not want you to have to wait. Perhaps there is something you can do, then. Soldiers have been hauling things away all day. Perhaps they could tell you where they've taken my lightning rods so you could get them back. At your service, sir. Begin your investigation at the market near the docks. I will stay here and help with the preparations. This is intolerable. I can barely conduct my research anymore. Everyone is having metal confiscated nowadays. Yes.
I'm sure you're seeing things, but I'll take the punch. There's a storm coming. Aye. Let's hope she demures until we're off duty. Stop, I tell you. Hey, darling. You work for a pie? Sure, if you bring your mates. Well, that's bleak. the last of it. Yes, it is, sir. Good. Put it with the rest. I wonder what Master Franklin plans to do with these rods. The storm's getting worse. Let's hurry back to Franklin. Goodness, quick! Help me with the rods! Portugal, Lisbon, I'd stake my life on it. Make yourself scarce, Shay. The militia will be here any minute. I'm sure they will have questions. What about you? I'm a devoted housekeeper. Right. <laughs> 